So with so many people are sleeping on Cardano right now, they're missing the big things that are taking place behind the scenes. And, and that's why I think that you, you can't stop what is happening. We know this worldwide expansion with Cardano and ADA is, is really growing quickly. There's a big partnership with Huawei and China, cloud infrastructure. We know that there's education going on in the Philippines. The Dubai police force is utilizing the Cardano blockchain to uh, store ballistic evidence. We know that in Africa, a major infrastructure overhaul, World Mobile trying to connect the unconnected, Cardano working with the African government, education happening there. And now this expansion actually may be continuing further, this time into Argentina. Now, what is happening here is Re President Milai, hopefully I'm saying that right, has been openly discussing the country's interest in blockchain and tech blockchain technology and crypto. As a fact, Milai has made several visits to the United States in the past few weeks, meeting up with major players in the crypto industry and discussing potential collaborations, particularly in the area of regulation in the process. This is not to mention that the recent moves by Argentina to tap El Salvador's Bitcoin strategies. According to the reports, Argentina aims to use the partnership to understand how El Salvador fosters Bitcoin adoption while staying compliant with crypto regulations. If you guys remember, back in 2021, El Salvador, I believe it was the first country to adopt Bitcoin as a legal tender. And it's kind of funny during the bear market, people were dogging them for doing so as prices drop, but looking pretty darn good now. Now, what's interesting about this as well is that Dar Dario Epstein, director at Research for Traders, which is located in Argentina, has also shared an interesting update on X as well. He hinted that a technology company specializing in third generation blockchain is currently in talks with him. Although he didn't mention Cardano uh, specifically, he said uh, it focuses on decentralized government, which fits the exact profile that, that was discussed. All right. Now, what's interesting is that the connection of Epstein's post to Cardano came from Charles Hoskinson's post about this. He said, Argentina has some of the brightest minds in our industry, and it has been a privilege to work with them. To cap it all, President Malaya also reposted Hoskinson's reply, further suggesting that this building tech collaboration or the budding tech collaboration has the highest support it needs to come to fruition. So right now, speculation. Right? We're speculating that this is happening, but... Honestly, this, this wouldn't surprise me because this is what I've been talking about. Cardano's focus is worldwide infrastructure, building crypto education. This fits the path that we've been talking about time and time again. And this isn't, you know, this flashy, you know, show, right? It's not, uh, I'm trying to think of the best way to describe this. It's not in your face type thing, right? Utilizing the Cardano blockchain in this way. But this is what I said would happen, right? Enterprise and governments utilizing the Cardano blockchain to, for worldwide infrastructure. Now, this is, again, just kind of in the early steps, but if this does happen, again, this validates what we've been saying. This plan, this process, you know, the, the direction of Cardano is much bigger than people are realizing right now. So there's, we still have to wait and see if this is going to be utilized, how it will be utilized, but it's, it's fun to speculate, right? But I appreciate you guys as always. I would love to hear your thoughts on this. Love to hear if you think this partnership is in fact going to take place, but have a great day. Show your love below. Catch you guys in the next one. Take care.